what Steph is doing right now. Okay, rookie of the year. Let's move on. Uh, Ernie, this is a tough one. It is, and again, with a lot of the awards, there were there was so much time missed by certain players, and when you're talking about all NBA teams and everything else, and now for Rookie of the Year, is it LaMelo Ball, is it Anthony Edwards, is it Tyrese Halliburton? Those are your top three, again, in no particular order. Where's the kid from the Knicks? Uh, Emmanuel Quickly? Yeah. Did not make the top three. Wow. But, and and I don't know if I don't think you can Who argue with those, most games? with those three. Yeah, Emmanuel yeah, Quickly's having a hell, heck of a year. He but, is, but has, and and they're winning. Uh, I, 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 yeah, I reward I winning. Quickly has been, he's been fantastic. No disappointment. Halliburton has got, well, if he's stuck in hell over there, but so we might not ever see him. But I tell you what, man. Well, are they winning because of him or are they winning? They winning partly because of him. Not, not partly. Yeah. Yeah. I, would, I, would, I would have no doubt that Quickly is first team all rookie. Yes. Okay. No but doubt. Ernie, did, see, Who missed the most games on, on this list, Ernie? Uh, Ball. Ball. Mello. Melo broke the wrist, the wrist yeah. yeah. But he he had the big lead, but Anthony Edwards came on great in the second half of the season. Edwards finished with 19 points a game, five rebounds, three assists. Lamelo 16, six and six, and, uh, and Lamelo's team was up to number four yeah, in the East before he got point. hurt and uh, Haywood got hurt. Yeah. And Albert, plus, and, by the way, 13, three and five. But the difference, the 47 percent and 41 percent. But, but the difference, year. the difference with Ball is. Yeah, I agree with you, Chuck. His his ability to see things oh. and his plays are impactful. Like they 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 change momentum or they increase momentum. Uh, I think that's that separate what Charlotte has not seen in the last you know since Kemba's been gone and they haven't seen anything like this in a while. Uh, it's up in the air, but I would I would vote Lamelo. Okay. I, 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 I would just barely edge out Anthony. Yeah, I mean, I think barely. Edwards made it very interesting. But, but, again, but again, only, I, because, uh, only because LaMelo got hurt, though, Ernie. Yeah, that's but, what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. He, he, he made it interesting. He did. I'm trying to look at real quickly at, at uh, and, and no pun intended, uh, quickly started three games, came off the bench in 61 others. Um, his number's not as good as Tyrese Halliburton, yeah. who had more starts, too. Yeah. So, I mean, I, I really well, think Mr. Mr. Halliburton. I know Halliburton had a great year, but he's on a, you know, a team that's not doing well at all. Yeah, well. has nothing to do with Again. team. It has everything to do with the individual. Let's move on. <laughs> you bums keep, you know, changing the rules. Hey, but Defensive you know, player you of the year. Can't make your team win. No, sixth man of the year. Sixth man of the not year. Not by yourself, no. Got two, got two members of the Utah Jazz in there. Well, Jordan it's, Clarkson or Joe Ingles or Derrick Rose. Hey, listen, I love the me top some, three for I six lo- men. I love me some Derrick Rose, but this is an easy one for Jordan Clarkson, in my opinion. Yeah, Jordan Clarkson, man, I mean, the microwave. They're the all in, winning. The, the, the invention, and yeah. they're winning. Anytime they're you winning. get to invention, oh, okay. okay, I have a question, Shaq. Uh, so if everybody's on. winning, no, no, let, let, how do you, let, then what would you do? Right here, if everybody's winning, the guy who has the, more of an impact. So everybody here is winning, right? Right. Knicks are winning. Utah's winning. Utah's right. winning. I like Jordan Clarkson a little bit better. Because you know why? Because individually, what he does as a player, his individual talents. But I, I think <laughs> MVP, I, I think it's all, it's, it's, I think you have to put, team. I'm not saying that one is, like, I think that you, you're not valuing winning what I think it should, I'm not saying it's the only criteria. I'm saying that it, it should be in your equation on dissecting if the person's going to get it. Some guys have better teams. They do. But they they might be the reason the team is better. True. Maybe. You know, what do you mean, saying. maybe? Uh, maybe. What do you mean, maybe? Joe Ingles, by the way, maybe. barely makes that as, as a sixth man because you got to come off the bench more than you start. He started 30 games, came off the bench in 37 games. Mm. Uh, I actually had Bobby Portis. Uh, Bobby at, had a good year. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, great uh, great three-point uh, accuracy he off did. the uh, Milwaukee bench. He really did. Defensive player of the year. Uh, I mean, he was one of my top three. I had Jordan Clarkson winning it. Um, defensive Player of the Year: Rudy Gobert, Draymond Green, or Ben Simmons. Wow, this, this is like the, the three that are always in it. Um, this is a tough one right here. Okay, then who you got? Uh, this award changed over the years, in you guys' opinion. What, what do, do you, you mean, mean changed? No, it's still for the best defensive player. No, no, but I'm. Uh, uh, ha ha ha. <laughs> 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 when, I'm, when I'm thinking of defense player of the year, especially in our area, I'm thinking of Gary Payton, like lockdown. Yeah, but nobody locks down anymore. When I finish, I'm thinking about, you know, guys like, you know, uh, 
uh, Lonzo Mourning, Dikembe Mutombo, who block everything at the rim. Everything except mine, but they block Well, everything. Rudy Gobert blocks everything. No, you don't. Uh, I, no, you don't. I, I get what Shaq no. is saying. Right? Maybe, right? maybe there were – I would say – I mean, that defensive these three player, guys are defensive very... Defensive player of the year to me, I mean, you can't score in the do. Nobody can score in the do, period. Yeah. And GP was like that. See what I'm saying? Alonzo Mourning, Dikembe Mutombo, they were like that. So I'm just asking you. There's a, that, 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 Gobert, they can be scored Gobert on. Gobert did lead the league in block shots. No, but I'm, I'm saying, I think what, what, what uh, Shaq is saying, what, I, I kind of understand that, yeah, you could score on Gary Payton. You could score on the Mutombo or, or Mourning. But there was a fear factor yeah. the night before you played them. And there was a game-changing plan. What I want to know is, do these three t- guys, when you're the opposing coaches drawing up their offense, do they, do they alter the game plan? When the game guys he named, the teams we played, the guys we played, they, we wouldn't run certain plays or do certain things because they were on the floor. I'm not sure if those three guys, they're great defenders. Draymond played some great defense last night. Right, great. But do you change your offense because they're on the floor? No. Okay. No. That, but that's what that's what but those other guys. Who's your pick, Chuck? I went go bear. Uh, I, I actually, I, I'm not. I'm not going to act like I'm a was a great defender. Um, I don't know. I, 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 I thank goodness I don't have a vote. I'm I would, gonna, I would go with Draymond. Yeah. I, because would, because he concentrates on it more than I think any other aspect of his game. And so he, he's better at it because of that. So I, I, I think, you know, Ro, Rudy is still asked to score. Ben is asked to run the show. Well, Draymond's just like, no, you lock down this guy tonight. We don't really need you to score. Pass the ball. You look last night. You know, this is what makes to me. Well, he took he, it to a little extreme last yeah, night. Yeah, but this is why Steph Curry to me is They so got a great. top five defense. Yeah, but think about it. Steph is so great that his second best score on a player on the team doesn't look to score. Mm-hmm. Like, the second best player on the Golden State Warriors doesn't look to score. Well, that's, like, that's, that's, a, that's a problem. That's, let's that's my let's get to these last two categories before we take a break. And uh, this is a tough one right here, buddy. Coach of the year, Quinn Snyder, Tom Thibodeau, Monty Williams. And you saw Monty Williams from the National Basketball Coaches Association got the nod from them the other day. I'm but gonna all three to me deserve I mean, it. Yeah, you can make a case for all three. You know, best record in the league. You know where the Knicks have come from, where Phoenix has come from. So I think in the West, I have to go with Monty. I think, you know, yeah. But there's would, only one. There's, there's not a well, Western the West. Eastern. Because well, of the Western going, Conference, I would go with Monty. Okay. I'm going with Monty because nobody expected him to be number one. Nah, no, not number one. Ever. Two. Yeah, not Well, but, no. they, but they got two All-Stars. And no, uh, I, uh, and Boston I love, got two I, All-Stars, I love, too. Who? Boston Celtics got two All-Stars. Yeah, he's, not, they're not on, he's not on the list. That's his point. No. no. I said nobody expected Phoenix to be number two, and you said they should be. They have two All Stars. I don't. I thought Phoenix was gonna have a good team. Yeah, but, but, but I'm think saying there's gonna be number two. Uh, uh, that's probably fair. But where the Knicks came from this year, uh, I got to give it to Tibbs this year because nobody expected the Knicks. The Knicks have uh, they're the number four, and uh, you just got to get that Tibbs credit. I mean, that's incredible what he did there. Uh, most improved player. Uh, the nominees or the finalists are. Uh, oh, this is easy. Oh, uh, the guy on the far right. You think? Oh, no question. Who, who this ain't even close. All Michael Porter Jr. There. and Jeremy Grant. This ain't even close here. So the most improved player will come out of those Man. three. Randall is, first of all, he's second team all NBA, yeah, in my yeah. opinion. Uh, is he improved or 20, is he on a night, natural course to being great? Like he, you know. He, but nobody thought he was going to be. 24, he, 10, and 6. 24, 10, and 6 yeah. career numbers. Yeah, yeah I know, no, but I'm saying I, I, I'm, not, I'm, st- I'm not shocked. Yeah, yeah, you. I, I'm, I, I, I didn't, I didn't think he well. was a 24, 10, and six guy. 24, 10, maybe. Right. But Jeremy Grant, I'm shocked. And they're winning too. I'm a little shocked that he's playing that well. Like, man, Jer- I, I, you know, Julius was great in college and always thought of as a great player.